You know, the last time I saw you was on the set of uh, General Hospital. Ah. And, yeah. and look at us now. Yeah. It's all, it's all the same. It's all connected. <laughs> see, for, for you it is. But see, they don't get that. They're like, wow, he's in this like big movie with Mr. Danny Boyle directing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And then he's in General Hospital. You, you love to break it up. And, and, yeah. And, yeah. And, yeah. Although, I think, um, I was telling Danny this, uh, when I met Danny for this movie, he wanted me to read. Danny likes to have actors read, and um, I think it's actually a good thing. You know, you're okay with that. I'm okay with it because I've been in school for directing the past two years, and I understand the idea that a director is looking f not just not not to judge actors, but just to find the right fit. Sure. So I th I, I think readings are fine, and actually for my sake, like I don't want to do a movie that I not right for. I'll I'll just look bad, and nobody will be served. Anyway, he had me read. He, and he was in L.A. when he wanted me to read, and I was in New York, so I, I had to fly out for a night, and he didn't give me any pages in advance. And so when I got there, he gave me what became one of the video speeches mm -hmm. in, in the film, where the character talks to this yes. video camera. And it was almost like a page long. It's a lot, it was a lot of dialogue. Like a monologue, almost. Yes, yeah, well, it, that's what it was, a yeah. monologue, but yeah. in, in the context of the film, it's... it's kind of justified as a, as a message to his family. Mm -hmm. And I think a lot of actors would have a hard time memorizing all mm -hmm. that all that material. But not James Franco, <laughs> why? I had just been on General Hospital. <laughs> That's right! <laughs> we had to memorize like 60 to 70 pages a day. <laughs> see? So that's really like... And I got the role. See? So, so because of General Hospital, you're doing a movie yeah. with Academy yeah. Award winning director, right? I, I think so. You worry about your actors sometimes, and so I remember before we got into shooting, Danny kept saying little things like, "You're gonna go insane. Oh, this is gonna be crazy. <laughs> yeah, that's wrong. Right. 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 I think you're gonna lose your mind in there." But did that help you? And and the reading did help me. I mean, I, I think my conscious state was altered a little bit just from the filming process. At least the way I approached acting was altered, certainly because as soon as we got out of the canyon and started doing different scenes with other actors and more conventional scenes I almost felt like I wasn't able to do it in a way or I, when I was doing it it just felt weird going through that experience in the canyon really did kind of alter me in a bit it took you a while to kind of shake that off then I think so yeah, yeah. to McDonald's yes I did so did I how old were you I was 16 I was like 18 or 19 yeah so yeah. And what was that like was that your first job uh no um I got fired from plenty of jobs before that when I was in high school. Uh, golf course, I drove the car to pick up the balls in the driving range. Uh, what else? I did some construction, uh, worked at the uh, cafeteria at UCLA. Uh, yeah, so McDonald's was at the, the end of a long line of very prestigious jobs. Prestigious jobs. <laughs> that I got fired from, and, you know, no. all, all of them which I got fired from. And look at you now. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Congratulations. Thank you. Yeah, you, you did a, a terrific job. Thank you. Always a pleasure to see you. Good to see you. When are you going back on uh, General Hospital? <laughs> uh, I, I will. Um, maybe, in a, maybe in a year. Okay. I think, actually, uh, I'm going to direct a couple of episodes. Oh, oh, oh breaking news. Exclusive. Yeah, yeah, breaking news. Exclusive. exclusive. Probably exclusive. breaking. Extra exclusive. <laughs> Excellent. Look out, Mr. Boyle. <laughs> oh, I know. Right? <laughs> That's awesome. Congratulations. Cool. Thank Tom. you.